is an audio book of interchange english grammar and composition of class 9 chapter 13 part 3 scene text 6 page number 146 expressing condolence and sympathy read the sympathy letter and do the activities that follow damak 9 thapa october 14 Dear Sarita, I was shocked to learn about the premature passing of your husband. He was a wonderful person and always was always ready to help others. His death has caused an immeasurable loss not only to your family but to all of us. I express my sincere sympathy to you in your profound bereavement. May God grant you enough courage to withstand this shock. Hamid. Show what you know. A Find the words which are similar in meaning to the following words: lovely, heartfelt, commiseration, c o m m i s e r a t i o n, bravery, resist. B. Write T for true and F for false statements. A. Hamid didn't attend the funeral because he didn't like it. B. Hamid is perhaps one of his colleagues. C. Hamid has written the sympathy letter. D. The sympathy letter is for Sarita. E. Hamid lives in Damak. C. Answer the following questions. A. Who will receive the sympathy letter? B. Who uh, has written the letter? C. When was the letter written? D. What was Sarita's husband like? E. What is the letter about? Scene text seven. Expressing condolence and sympathy. Now read the one act play a disaster and attempt the question that follow title a disaster characters pratik 18 years old boy paru pratik's mother dharmender neighbor kumar pratik's father gayatri pratik's grandmother rajamati neighbor setting at 11:55 saturday morning baisakh 12 2072 bikram sambat Pratik Kumar and Paru are on the top floor of the three-story building enjoying the weekend. Suddenly they were hit by a powerful earthquake. Scene. Pratik. Baba earthquake. He screams. He tries to run but can't. Kumar. Yes. Paru. Oh my god. She goes to Pratik and Kumar. They hold each other. It's very big. Oh god, what is going to happen? Where is mother? She must be frightened. Let's go down. All struggle to uh, down to second story and find Gayatri yelling and trembling. Kumar, let's go down. Hurry up! All run down to an open field nearby. Scene two: People trying hard to make calls, running towards the open fields. Children crying. Elderly people praying. Again, they feel an aftershock. All scream. Pratik tries to make a call, but network is busy. Meanwhile, he receive a call. Hello? Yes. Don't worry, we all are safe here. I can't believe it's line disconnected. Gayatri, who's that? Pratik, my friend Norbu from Australia keeps trying to get updates from FM radio as he informs people around him. It's 7.8 on the Richter scale and its epicenter is Gorkha. All look shocked and scared. Pratik keeps listening to radio. Gayatri, oh god, have mercy upon us. Is this the end of our life? What shall I do, Pratik? Everyone, listen. Do you know what this massive earthquake did? Tharara, Basantapur, Darbar Square, Patan Darbar Square, temples and many houses have collapsed. Paru, oh dear, what a pity! Today is Saturday, and there must have been so many people on the tower. What is going? What is going to happen? What's next, Kumar? That's too bad. Any human casualty? Um, perhaps a lot. All shocked. Other people also joined the crowd. Scene three. In the evening, people are sitting, talking, uh, ta- uh, talking about whatever they have heard during the day. Some are moaning and sobbing. Young people are pitching tents and fetching mats and blankets to stay overnight in the field. Tremors keep continuing. Dharmender, I don't think we can get into our houses tonight. It's better to stay under the open sky. Razamati, I'm not going anywhere from here. There is always chance of tremors similar to that. Every tremor, wi- tremor will definitely makes us uh, run out of our houses. She unfolds her mattress and blanket. 
Paru. Pratik, have you got any other, any further updates? Pratik, Ama, you can't hear this all. The updates will make you burst into tears. Anyway, we should stay strong. Many houses, public buildings and monuments in Kathmandu, Bhaktapur and Lalitpur have been brought down. So far, some 150 deaths have been confirmed in the valley itself. It feared that the death toll would be much higher than what we reckon. Kumar, I'm really sorry, but the reports say there must have been much more devastation in Sindhapalchok and Gorkha. Everyone silent. All of them spent the night in the field with their family. Scene 4. By Sak 13. People gather and share their views on post-earthquake situations. Most look dumbfounded because of the frequent aftershocks. Dharminder, I have heard that almost all the houses in Sindhupalzok have been destroyed. Razamati, Gorkha is another more serious hit district. That toll is on the rise. Reporters say tremors are felt further west too. However, damage is not as serious as in the central region and Gorkha in the western region. Kumar, are skyscrapers in the valley safe? I doubt. Old and poorly constructed buildings must have crumbled. Why do people neglect basic things at the time of construction? It's a pity that our own houses are turned into our own graveyards. Children are playing hide and seek. They look carefree. The fear is high in grown-ups. Paru. If people were aware to go in the safe places at the time of earthquake, human casualties would not be so high. At the time of emergency, we should either be under safe construction or we should reach safe places like parks or open fields. Another important thing I have learned now is we should always have an emergency bag ready. At least we could feel a little secure. Gayatri, I'm terribly sorry about the deaths. It's nothing other than sin of sinful people in this world. The very sin is now having us all cry and lament. A truck of army passes by. Dharminder, there must be going, they must be going for rescue operations. Poor quality of land might be the reason of some destruction. So many houses have been illegally erected. They get permission for two or three story construction, but they go beyond that. So this was sure. All citizens are sitting together in the sun. Pratik, Nepal's earthquake is the top story in the world. Our government has already sent rescue and relief teams. We are getting national and international level help and support for rescue, relief and resettlement. People have started raising donations, goods, food, clothes and other materials through local clubs, institutions and organizations. The siren of an ambulance is heard. Gayatri, the ambulance takes my breath. Paru, we should all cooperate from our quarters to help the nation carry out the rescue, relief and resettlement of the needy ones. Hope these skilled rescue teams, relief materials and donations arrive on time to the real victims. They feel another tremor. All keep silence in fear. Show what you know. A. Read the one act play and find the words that are similar to the following. Shrieks. S-H-R-I-E-K-S. Fierce, scared, pity, victim, groaning, dreadfully, bringing, new information, great harm, help, safe, symmetries, express sadness, elderly. B. Read the one act play and find the words that are opposite to the following weak, destruction, cruelty, laughing, private. Legally, good, uncertain, pious, P-I-O-U-S. I might be wrong with the pronunciation, but the spelling is P-I-O-U-S. Bottom. C. Match the following words with their definitions. Column A. Death toll, epicenter, earthquake, the Richter scale, R-I-C-H-T-E-R, aftershock. Column B. A sudden movement of an earthquake and which is less violent than the first main movement. A system used to measure the strength of an earthquake. The point on the earth's surface directly above an earthquake. A sudden violent movement of the earth's surface. The number of people who die because of an event. D. Solve the following crossword puzzle using the hints given. Across, four, 
statues or buildings that are built to honor special persons or events. Down, one, very tall modern buildings usually in a city. Two, so shocked that you cannot speak. Three, cause something to break into small pieces. Five, a slight earthquake. E, answer the following questions. A, where was Pratik uh, when the earthquake occurred on Baisak 12? B, what was Gayatri doing when Pratik, Kumar and Paru saw her? C, what did the people do immediately after they felt the first big shock? D, what was the magnitude of the earthquake and where was its epicenter? E, what does Gayatri think of the earthquake? F, what are some of the reasons of the destruction? Scene text 8. Criticizing and expressing degrees of probability. Go through the views in the boxes below and find the answers to these questions. Azmera. Oh, Uttar, a mo new mobile set? The previous week I saw another one and today it's another. Aren't you troubling your family like this? Doesn't satisfaction have any space in you? You should learn to be satisfied with what you have. You shouldn't. Fill in the blanks. Uttar, excuse me, I'm not troubling my family and self-satisfaction is not everything. We should try to keep up with the changing world. We should strive for success. If people believe in what you say, then the world will come to a standstill. Comma, fill in the blanks. Chandra, um, you're right, but it's not that we should always long for pros progress and forget to cherish what we have. One should always have self-satisfaction, for every progress is made to achieve satisfaction. Both satisfaction and progress are equally important. However, it's our progress that introduces us to the world, not our self-acceptance. Do we make progress for satisfaction or fill in the blank? Beam. Hey guys, all of you are trying to be Aristotle. It seems to be a chicken and egg situation to me. But I think self-satisfaction and progress should go hand in hand. I will give you an example of a great man, Abraham Lincoln, who had the quality of self-acceptance along with a strong flair for progress. He failed in business at the age of 21, was defeated in legislative election at the age of 22, failed again in business at age 24, lost a congressional race when he was 34, lost a senatorial uh, election at 45, failed in an effort to become vice president at age 47, lost a senatorial race when he was 49, and was elected president of the United States at the age of 52. Uttar. Humans are by instinct never satisfied and always inquisitive for progress. Our minds should always be striving for new inventions. The development of the world to this stage from the Stone Age has been possible only due to our own need for progress. Our self-acceptance as advocated by Ajmera can turn us into self-satisfied ambitionless mammals. What do fill in the blanks? Ajmera. I beg your pardon? If you only go for success and progress, then a day will come when you will stand alone without friends and families because you will have lost them all in the never-ending race to prosperity and success. That's the reason why I think satisfaction is far more valuable than progress. You should be satisfied with that you have because the things which you possess now were once part of your progress and now you don't value them. I strongly suggest you not to fill in the blanks. Chandra, this will never end. Let's go. We are getting late. Show what you know. Page number 152. A. Find the similar meaning to the following words or phrases. Recent. Struggle. Adore. Contentment. Evolution. Wealth. B. Find the words which are opposite in meaning to the following words. Wrong. Remember. Insignificant. Past. Useless. C. Match the following. A. Success. B. Inquisitive. C. Progress. D. Flair. E. Legislative. And another uh, column is 1. Curious. 2. Favorable outcome. 3. 
uh, having the power to make laws for a sudden brief burst of bright flame or light. Five, forward movement. D, write T for true and F for false statements. A, Ajmera is troubling her family. B, Bhim said that both satisfaction and progress are equally important. C, Abraham Lincoln failed in business at the age of 22. D, according to Uttar, our minds should, have, should always be striving for new inventions. E. According to Ajmera, satisfaction is far more valuable than progress. E. Answer the following questions. A. Why does Uttar always try to possess new things? B. Why does Uttar suggest not being self-satisfied? C. What is the complaint of Ajmera? D. Why is satisfaction more valuable than progress according to Ajmera? E. What does we uh, mean by saying it seems to be a chicken and egg situation? Scene text 9, criticizing and expressing degrees of probability. Read people's view about building a cinema hall and do the activities that follow. Opening a cinema, local people's views. An entertainment-related company plans to open a cinema in a newly developed town in the far western part of Nepal. The company sent some of their surveyors to ask the people's views. The views collected express the likely result of the cinema. Harina Ramzali, Parigaon. Surely the cinema will spoil our children. They are bound to take money from home and go to the cinema instead of school. The schools are unlikely to be able to control the children. The purpose cinema may be a big nuance with low income. N-U-I-S-A-N-C-E Jaimati Parki, Lal Dhunga. Delighted to know about the new proposal. The cinema is certain to generate jobs in our area. People likely to learn modern trends through films for our locality. People might get to know a lot of things about cleanliness, education, human rights, safe motherhood, and women empowerment. Bande Bhatta, Chudeli Rupal. Only the FM radio kills half of our working time. The cinema is certain to consume the whole. All are likely to be crazy about the films once they see one. Where to get the money for them all? Single bread earners like me are sure to have very hard times. Besides, people might turn disinterested in their local cultures and meals. The new generations may forget our age along um, traditions and culture. Does anybody want to buy my land and house? I will migrate somewhere else. Zagarnath uh, Bohara, Kotal. The cinema is likely to bring both good and bad changes in the society. Our children may not give much time to their studies. Young people will probably adopt the bad culture of selfishness, willingness, and violence as found in the movies. But at the same time, they will get to know lots of new and good things. The local authorities might not be able to systemize how often one can go to the cinema. Anyway, you can't prevent something that is taken as the sign of development. Show what you know. A. Find the similar meaning to the following words. Amusement or pleasure. A long way. Opinions. A particular area. Recent. Very interested in something. Proposed plan. Create. Very pleased. Acceptable. B. Find the opposite meaning to the following words, undeveloped, near, old-fashioned, double, interested, national, selflessness, inappropriate, inappropriate. C. Match the following. Adopt, surveyor, uh, systemize, uh, sorry, systematize, human rights, trends. In the other column, there is general developments or changes in a situation. The basic rights, which is generally considered all people should have. Accept or start to use something new. To plan a system for something. Pers persons who, uh, jo whose job are to examine the views of others. D. Solve the following crossword puzzle using the hints given. Across. 2. Move from one place to another. 3. 
all the people of about the same age 5 thinking of one's own advantage 6 behavior which is intended to hurt injure or kill people down 1 authority or power given to someone to do something 4 something or someone that annoys or causes trouble for you e answer these questions 1 is harina positive about opening a cinema hall why or why not 2 what are Jaimati's uh, remarks about opening a cinema? 3. Who is concerned about local cultures and meal, uh, melas? Uh, sorry, I, I think I misread it. It's written meals earlier, but it's supposed to be melas. Do you agree with him or her? Who is? Uh, I'll repeat question number 3. Who is concerned about local cultures and melas? Do you agree with him or her? 4. Who presents a balanced view on cinema? Do you agree with him or her? 5. Which I what is your opinion on opening a cinema in your locality? Number 6. According to the text, who are for and against opening the cinema?